Son, I will not stop searching until I bury you. Reads the shirts of relatives of those who disappeared in the state of Guerrero. They've come to pray at the site of what could be an enormous mass grave in the outskirts of Iguala. Everyone here thinks their loved ones are underneath the fields. My son, he never did anything bad. He was hard working. I taught him how to work in the fields. He wasn't doing illegal things. Mexico's drug war has left thousands dead. Some were also kidnapped by drug gangs and corrupt policemen. The victims are often innocent civilians. Margarita Canan lost two sons. She has traveled from another town to attend the service. After years of silence and fear, she says, missing people are now being reported. The presumed massacre of 43 students here two months ago brought a national outcry for justice and accountability. They won't listen to one person, but we are so many victims now, it's different. In two months, authorities have been swamped with new reports of disappearances, some recent and some dating back years. 50 DNA samples are taken on average every day, and 19 mass graves have been found. But there could be hundreds or thousands all over Mexico. What the relatives desperately ask for is closure, a proper burial for the loved ones. We've come to Iguala's May Cemetery, a place that many people here tell us is really too small given the number of people that have either been killed or disappeared in this area. The unidentified bodies are sent to the cemetery's common grave, but the director says he has already run out of space. Look at this. The entire area is full. The tombs go up to the cemetery wall. The reason is in these fields. Traffickers buried their victims far from their towns, and it appears many of the mass graves are in Iguala, where the mayor was allegedly a member of a drug cartel. The people say they won't wait until authorities exhume the graves. They have endured too much suffering and are taking the search effort into their own hands. Monica Villamizar, Al Jazeera, Iguala, Mexico.